Okay, so I'm trying to get myself back in shape, trying to look good. Today in LA Fitness, I saw a person working out by himself. So I asked him, hey, bro, do you want to work out with me? He said, yeah. Had no clue. He just got out the Marines. Five things I learned from, um, from working out with a Marine. Five. Number one, if you're not using weights, there is no set number. You just go till you can't go no more. I don't know if every military branch is like this. I don't know what they do in they cults. But in my world, if I do 20 push-ups, I'm doing 20 push-ups. Shots out to Willow. Why your parents named you Willow? I don't even know. Willow told me to do as many push-ups as I can. So in my mind, I was like, that's 25. Because I'm with a Marine, I'm going to knock out 35. I'm going to impress him. So when I got to like 35, he just looked at me like, don't get up yet. I said, no, I did 35. He was like, yeah, you got to do it to exhaustion. I said, in my mind, I'm exhausted already. Please get your hands off me. He was like, keep going now. I was a little afraid because if he would have put his hands on me, then I would have been able here to tell y'all this video. Um, if you go work out with a Marine, they are going to not force you, but they go mentally force you to do it to your body. Just say, you know how you have a voice in your head that talk to you? Your voice in your head gets scared. Your voice goes from saying words like, Josh, you ain't got to do this to, mm -mm, boy, mm -mm, voice, use words in my head. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Willow had me so scared, the voice in my head stopped using real words. Number two. Everything he tells you to do is going to start with, because a Marine would, everything. Every question I asked Willow, he talked about it like it was in third person. Hey, bruh, so you ever got tired? A Marine would never get tired. If a Marine got tired of a Marine, when they admit that he was tired, okay. Dog, so today ain't leg day. Now a Marine gonna do leg day every single day. Why stop when a Marine can get it going? Bruh, it's just me and you talking. Can you please stop talking like that? A Marine don't stop talking like nothing. You got a problem with the way a Marine talk? No. No, do you want me to do some more push up to exhaustion? I have no problem, Willow. No problem. Number three, going against what all these myths say, if they don't think you fit to be a Marine, they not trying to recruit you, they gonna put you off to another branch. I don't know what it was about me that screamed, Josh, you not a Marine, but Willow never invited me because I was telling him like, you know what, dog? I remember a couple years ago, I thought about going to the Marine. Nah, you wouldn't have made it, Josh. If you can't get through the workout that they're putting you through, and I promise you, it's probably 20% of what they normally do. If you can't get through that workout, you better not even talk about being a Marine with a Marine in a gym. Because they be doing stuff like he doing pull-ups without his hands. Where the hell are your hands at, Willow? Where are you, where are you ain't using hands, man? What kind of sorcery is this? Number four, although Marines are very approachable people, at any given time, they want it with anybody. I don't know what Marines are taught when they go through their training and whatnot, but it's some big dudes in LA Fitness. I mean, it's some six foot five, 280 pound, all I do is weights and steroid type dudes in LA Fitness. Willow had to be about five nine ish, 160 pounds. Maybe it was just me, but it was something about Willow's aura that said he'll kill every character that Keanu Reeves ever played. I mean, that's Neo in the Matrix. That's John Wick. That's when he said played 47 and Ronin. Everybody Keanu Reeves has ever played couldn't touch Willow. And I guarantee you, Willow was just a run in the mill Marine, bruh. I don't know what they're doing to the Marines. I don't know how y'all convinced them to have this attitude, but I want it. I want it in the bedroom. I want to be able to walk in the bedroom and say, I'm going to kill that. And number five, a workout is not complete until you run. When I go to the gym, I walk on the treadmill. I might hit a little incline button and I'm walking on the treadmill feeling good. Just building up a nice little sweat so I can go over there and pump some iron. When I say these men and women get in there and hard down sprint, I mean, they put the machine up to 8.0, bruh. It only go to 7.1. Why, why is it on 8.0? The math ain't even correct on the treadmill. Shut up and run. <clears throat> Remember that inner voice I told y'all about? Came out my head and said, Josh, I'm going to talk to you later. I'm by myself. It's just me, my caucus, and Willow looking at me like, you better not stop, bruh. If you ever go to the gym in a Marine, you know he's a Marine because y'all have some conversation, and a Marine tell you you want to work out with him, you know what you think? It's a Marine. Look how he built. They know karate. They know how to kill people. They can take a cigarette out your mouth, put it back in your mouth, and kill you later, like two weeks later. Don't do it. They are on a whore, a whore, a whore, another level of fitness, a whore. Eh ho! You're gonna hear what I say. Gonna give it to you straight. Just like Josh prayed. Ooh.